Correct. Kenny Manigault, unstoppable here in the first quarter. Herring feeds Shentu inside. Good move, Chris. Shentu flips it up and in. Patient move. Shentu is unavailable. They find themselves down by 11. Let's see if they can convert here. A bit of a dry spell for the Wolf Warriors, at least from the field. As Doug Herring going into the second half as well. Here is Doug Herring. Herring handling it. Herring got in. Herring with the left Doug hand. Herring. And there will be no heavy pitch. And just more aggressive on a lot of uh, areas here on the court. Also getting a ton of offensive rebounds. That's why they also have 10 more attempts. And that was, again, a 6 to nothing and back-to-back -back hits from downtown to create the double-digit advantage for the Black Bears as Doug Herring. He was bumped by Julian Boyd. Did not even matter for him. A bigger player challenged uh, Manigold there, but Christian deflected by Julian Boyd. So a counter steal, Doug Herring to the cup. And that's good for Doug, who is looking for the foul right after. Join their team in their attack zone right there. Douglas Herring with a talented finish. Now a nice pass forward. And time bring on the energy here on the bench, able to con after their uh, opening loss against the Taipei Fubon Braves. Doug Herring escapes from the baseline. And again, a lot of problems to be addressed for the Wolf Warriors in the coming games as Herring makes the same shot. Man, waiting for the down low. That's right. Julian Boyd taking and making for deep. Big shot. Julian Boyd. 